This is Journal How To. Today's How To video, we're going to be talking about radio reception on receivers. We have an older receiver here. You could tell it's not getting any reception. Even if I source it, it's just going to keep going and going, trying to find a channel that comes in clear enough to display. It's not going to. I don't have an antenna. Most of you guys who have radio receivers like this, you lost the antenna, which I did also. So I want to listen to music, and I can't. I don't have an antenna. I figured let me rummage through some wires. Everybody has those old cables for your cable box. This won't work. I have a USB cable that won't work. Then I also have a Cat5 cable for the internet. Everyone should have these. They come with all routers, modems. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna get yourself a pair of scissors. You're gonna get your cable itself and you're just gonna cut the end off. So when we come back on camera, I'm gonna show you how many wires we could use and uh, see if we can make ourselves a little bootleg antenna. All right, we're all finished. You can see I took about four or five of the wires. I spliced them together. I just rolled it as thin as possible. The rest I just cut off. You could leave it or cut it off. It's a little cleaner if you cut it off. So you're gonna go behind the receiver. And you're just gonna put the wire that you spliced into the antenna section. All right. Now we're gonna go back to the front and we're gonna see if it works. All right, nice clear radio reception. So basically run this behind your receiver, tape it to the wall, the higher it gets, the more reception you're gonna have, so. Nice, that's it, a little bootleg antenna. So I hope this little hack helps you guys. All right, subscribe, comment down below.